Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Pedro Fernandez. I'm a former San Francisco policeman, spent eight honorable years with the SFPD. I'm an investigative reporter in syndicated radio talk shows, as well as a licensed California private investigator. Um, I'm sort of miffed at the fact that Sheriff Mark McCarimi has been taken off his job without pay. Because, you know, when I look at the instances, of, of course, we call the pepper spray cop, where the cop, the sergeant of the police the college bureau up north sprayed those sitting demonstrators, he's still getting paid. The chancellor just resigned last week. He's still getting paid. And let me take you back to the case of the Sam School fire chief, when she hit her husband over the head, not once but twice, with a glass. Okay? And it was reported on a 911 tape where the husband said, I think my children are in danger. Okay? What did Gavin Newsom say? It's a family matter. Let the families let the family discuss it. It's a family matter. Well, guess what? Had the shoe been on the other foot and had a man hit a woman over the head with a glass bottle twice, okay, he would have been booked. I can tell you from my law enforcement career, he would have been booked, hands down. I think this is a political witch hunt. I think that Ross McGreamy was only the only progressive candidate on the, uh, that won election this past time on the, at the election. And I think because of that, he's being solely targeted by the mayor's office and by different bureaucrats in the city and county of San Francisco. It's a waste of time. It's a waste of taxpayers' money. And it's ruining this man's life. He hasn't seen his wife since January. As a policeman, I saw a lady stab her husband in the face with a knife, okay? And she got back with her husband within a month, stabbed him in the face. And then the district attorney's office allowed him to go back together after a month. This man's been separated from his family for four months. This is an injustice. And for you people to sit here and even consider misconduct charges against him, you should be considering misconduct charges against the mayor.